Hey everyone, Rarity Dash here, and uh, yeah, I got a big one today. This is something I have been very hyped for, and it is Kali's new album, Phantomime. Yep, the new Kali album is finally out, and uh, I'm really looking forward to going through it and uh, hearing what she has to offer this time. Uh, we'll be listening on YouTube Music, and of course I have already heard, I think, three songs from this. I've heard Tide... I've heard Overkill, and I've heard Midnight Mayoi. Uh, you can find my reactions to those three in other videos. But, um, yeah, we'll be starting with the second track on the album, Sneaking Revenge. Which, I mean, I have I have technically also heard the original Sneaking, but this version is apparently different. It's got the revenge, and uh, it also features Lotus Juice, who I know as the Persona 3 guy. The, the guy rapping on the Persona 3 soundtrack. Um, <laughs> and considering that, Callie uh, had to have just been, like... <laughs> I, I can't even imagine how she was, considering what a big fan of that game she is, when uh, this collab came through. Like, that's crazy. Just to think. <laughs> but it happened, and I'm eager to hear the result. I mean, Sneaking was never really one of my favorite Callie tracks, but maybe they made it better. Let's go ahead, start this, and see. Of course Wind turbine and I should have brought up the Universal Technical Sorry about Institute that. offers. Here, at least they're short. This sounds like a completely different song. <laughs> we still got this ridiculous kick though. This goes a lot harder than the first. Even with that dumb hook. Yeah, this instrumental is... <laughs> wow. This is like night and day. <laughs> Significant improvement. Alright. And now we have the one... Okay, I gotta actually... Um, so yeah, go-getters. <laughs> We're finally doing this. <laughs> I, I, it might seem like I've been putting this off. I mean, this is one of Callie's biggest songs ever. Like, one of the milestones of her career actually doing a song for an anime and um, I didn't react to it <laughs> until now <laughs> and that is entirely because 
If you don't know, I was waiting for the music video to come out, but it never materialized. So, um, yeah, I don't know. I, I think something behind the scenes must be happening there. But, um, yeah, I, I still want to hear it. Uh, I mean, I've got to hear it now. I mean, it's probably going to be performed at the concert uh, in a couple weeks, and I do plan to watch that. Um so it's time, it's time to hear this. Really excited, I mean, with this being such a big deal. Callie's first ever true Anna song. The actual ending of a seasonal anime. Um, yeah, really, really eager. Uh, I haven't heard uh, anything other than I, I heard a snippet of it used as the <laughs> soundtrack for that one uh, Isekai Squad, uh, or <laughs> Suicide Squad Isekai, <laughs> just call it Isekai Squad, um, that one uh, uh, preview she had during her uh, birthday live. Um, I watched that, and that it was, of course, uh, there in that, but I don't remember what it sounded like, so eager to finally hear the actual track. Anyway, here we go. Go get us. Love the vocals, love the instrumental. This is smooth. Okay, well that was different. <laughs> I don't know what I expected, but I don't think it was that kind of sound. Uh huh. Um. Yeah, that was cool. <laughs> that was different. Um. Yeah, I. Uh, 
I'm a bit speechless after that. I mean, the not what I was expecting. Um, but uh, it, I mean, the sound was great. Like just sonically, like uh, a lot going on there. But I think it all worked pretty well. Um, it's the kind of song where. I, I feel like I mean not I, I liked it from the get go, but I feel like it'll grow on me a lot as it, I go on as I hear it more. Um, uh, like it's the kind of song that I, I just feel like I'll get more attached to with time. But uh, even at first listen, I think the the production was excellent. Cali sounded really cool. There were a lot of interesting musical ideas there. Um, not too much I can glean lyrically. I figure I feel like it was mostly in Japanese, and uh, there were a few good lines in there that were in English. But um, yeah, but um, yeah, really cool. Really enjoyed that. Anyway, we're moving on. We're skipping over Overkill because obviously I've heard it. Uh, going to Cult Following. Don't know much about this one. I guess this is the first one where I go in with absolutely no expectation. But uh, let's see what we got after another quick ad. Okay. Sinister start. Oh wow. Okay.
Okay. Wow. Um. Yeah, I didn't know Callie had quite that in her. That's uh, that's impressive. Like that kind of. Wow. That was, um. That was a whole different kind of energy. Like I mean. It follows up Overkill, which is on its own I mean, a fairly metal track, but uh, <laughs> this kind of took it up a notch. This is, uh, wow. Um, I love the lyrics. I mean, it, it, there weren't a lot of them. I feel like we repeated them, but we did change them up a little bit for like the last bit, which I liked. Um, but uh, they still stood out. Um, and it uh, just, I, I, I love what happened there, <laughs> just musically. <laughs> just Callie going full metal with her vocal delivery. And uh, um, I mean, of course, the music, that was great. That might be my favorite so far. <laughs> I got to hear that again. Uh, I'll wait until after I've heard the rest. Uh, listen again on my own time. But uh, already excited for the re-listen because of that. <laughs> Damn, that was good. Uh, moving on, we got Don Mai. Saving on your education should be a right, not a competition. At University of Phoenix, you'll get the best. Okay. How do we follow that up? Probably with something completely different. Still going fairly heavy with the rock. Oh, we got some, got some horns. Okay, love the vocals. Okay, this is smooth. This good. This is an interesting mix too, but it's like really jazzy, but it's, then it's also metal. I don't know how common that is, jazzy.
myself, don't mind, cause I'm better than all wow. of me. <laughs> I'm just impressed in so many ways by this. Like, this is. That was incredible, too. It's Callie's vocals and the music and everything there was just great. And uh, after that, apparently, we bring it fully back down with Midnight Mioi, chill out, and uh, go through that with Kobo. And uh, after that, because we already heard that, we've got Hold Skeletons. On, just okay. let it go. Valentine? It all. Time to decide. Belt Skeletor. Save and reload. Time to decide. A hand running low. One time. It's all too broken inside. So decide how. Just let it go, shatter it all Time to decide, tide's got a tongue Savory lot, time to decide A hand running low on time It's all too broken inside So decide, side of my control We'll just stay on the down low no I like how she's doing the vocal here. It's different than usual. Okay. Picking it up a bit. Not a not a full dial, I guess. song in terms of like the structure like with how it's going I don't think she's gonna rap again I was just have one very atypical structure Another just phenomenal one, though. <laughs> wow. Save twenty percent on denim last days. Huh? Your old denim during Target's denim take back event. Drop off your old items from any brand at a Target store. Now give me full ad. Denim apparel with Target Circle. Redeem the Target Circle bonus in store and on Target.com. Oh. Maybe I should have gone with Spotify. Okay, here we go. Just 
distance driving roadless feels like the end of a life driving roadless again feels, uh, I love the reference <laughs> almost missed the more obvious one feels like an end of a life Sing it, Kelly. There's like a real optimistic feel, I guess, to the end of there, kind of, in a weird way. Um, like, just in how it was arranged, the music. Um, I don't know. There's something in me there. Like, it, it almost started to feel kind of idle, idly, which I guess is kind of fitting, uh, <laughs> in a way. <laughs> like... Um, I don't know, it just kind of struck me in a way. But that was another great song. Really cool. Working got one more. Has its and then I'll probably do the bonus track as well. Like one. Okay. Acoustic. Through the blue. Join you up in the sky. 
Drama drags a little bit longer I figured that by now I'd grow a little bit taller Would you be kinda disappointed in me? Or would we laugh and so we cry? Simplest song in the album, but it's honestly one of the best. you Kelly <laughs> we're gonna end it on that note I'm just the clapping huh <laughs> I don't know about that that's kind of a bit of a um, about delivering a better experience at an awesome price or maybe she wants us to be disappointed it's the personal price plan theorem if you bundle home <laughs> and auto that can equal Okay, and here we have the bonus track with you, and I have no idea who that is, but let's see. Yeah, that's karma. Yeah, get down. Thing that's in the park. So 
still, it's good to hear the song again. Yeah, not very different from the other version, and considering I don't know who Yoon is, <laughs> I of course prefer the version where it's just Callie singing. Um, um, so yeah, this is Callie's best album ever. <laughs> Definitely her best full full length album. I mean, I love uh, both uh, both uh, uh, Unalive and uh, Cinderella. But, uh, yeah, this blew them out of the water. <laughs> like, those are both really good albums. I'm proud to have them on my wall. Uh, I mean, I do have one a lot, but yeah. <laughs> I forget which ones I do, because, I mean, uh, oh, it's, uh, Shinigami Note is the one that I got the, the box version of, uh, which is where most of those little posters come from. Uh, I got another box for this one, which is on its way. Um, so you got the dead box version. I don't think there is an album version. Um, I mean, maybe there will be eventually, uh, but by that point, probably won't get it. I mean, I did eventually get the album you might have noticed of uh, her EP last year, uh, the Jigoku Six, uh, <laughs> which yes, I did have to look over for the title. Uh, but um, yeah, um, uh. But yeah, this is her best full-length album, and one of her best just releases, period, I feel like. Like, I, I'm trying to think what could possibly top this. I mean, Your Mori is an all-time classic, uh, where every song is excellent. But, uh, I mean, this might, just in terms of even cons consistency, this might even beat that, I think. Because if you thinking about even of the, the, the songs we didn't hear today, Tide, that's one of Callie's best songs. I feel like that's one I go to again and again. Overkill, I also really like that one. Um, Midnight Mayoi, very cool vibe. Uh, it, it, I feel like it maybe doesn't stand out as much as some songs. Like it's not not really a hype song at all. It's just so chill, and I feel like maybe that's why the video. <laughs> it's also not a very interesting music video, so I, I feel like that's why that one doesn't have uh, as many views as some of her releases but uh yeah all things considered i think i was more impressed with the album tracks than the singles on this which is kind of becoming a thing with these hall live releases i think i said the same thing about Kanata's album uh and i think another another one maybe, like every toe album ever <laughs> or so ep whatever whatever toy does i love her uh <laughs> i love her album tracks uh, but, um, yeah, I think the best song on the album is Cult Following, um, followed probably by Don't Mai and then Through the Blue. Like, those three, I think, stand out. Skeletons and Last Days were also excellent. Um, and my opinions might change. Like, Skeletons, like, just the whole structure of it was just so odd to me. <laughs> like, it just did not have the typical song structure. Uh, 
So I'll have to get used to that, I feel. But I, I like what I heard a lot. And Last Days, that was cool, too. I like how it ended. Um, uh, and, I mean, even Sneaking Revenge, I think, is such an improvement over the original. <laughs> and it took what was kind of <laughs> a somewhat subpar Kali song, to be honest. Uh, just a bit too silly and it made it pretty epic i mean lotus juice helps a lot like he's got a cool voice and he, he brings the <laughs> he really brings it to the track and and Callie, i mean she's the, the music stepped it up i think that's the big the biggest thing there uh just the music went hard and it was just a much better version um and um i feel like i have the least to say about go getters honestly like, I know it's the big song. It's the one that was in the anime, but uh, I feel like it's probably the safest thing here. Like, it is such a story of production. Like, uh, like just the producers really went all out in making something that people would look at and like, I think. Um so, and there's artistry to that. Like, uh, I, I feel like I, I'm not going to knock the song as anything. Uh, <laughs> like, it's, it's a really good song, but it's really good in ways that maybe aren't as interesting to me as Colt's Following or Don't My. Um, I don't know. But uh, I did still like it, and I'm probably going to be listening to it a lot. I mean, now I can finally... <laughs> watch people reacting to it like all these people um even outside the usual hollow life people who just people who just were reacting not to cali but to the suicide squad isekai opening and ending or whatever uh, <laughs> which i don't know what the opening is but <laughs> I, i'm not currently planning to watch the anime so i might as well just spoil that i guess for myself uh <laughs> i mean i've heard kind of good things about the anime. maybe it's worth it but um and Cal they did hire Callie to, so maybe I owe it to them to watch it eventually. Um, but, um, yeah, great stuff. Um, I mean, I was expecting it to be good. I'm always expecting it to be good. But this is, like, for sure, uh... <laughs> Some of her best stuff that she's done so far. And uh, I'm really just blown away by how how good this was. Like, <laughs> like I, I mean, I, I don't feel like anything that she's done with Universal has really hit and resonated with me quite as much as this. I mean, I've still liked it. I've still enjoyed it. But uh, this release, much more than the last three, I feel like just uh, it, it really helped, uh, like, remind me of why I love Callie in the first place. I think this is just some excellent, excellent music, and I can't wait to re-listen to these songs. Um, <laughs> great stuff uh yeah and uh <laughs> i could probably repeat myself a few more times but i think i'm gonna cut it there hope you guys enjoyed the reaction let me know if you did and see you in the next one